Okay, so uh, this is Bobby Dale before the uh, Wimbledon game. Bobby, um, you obviously you've been out on loan this season. It's been a quite a season of change here at Cheltenham. How much have you sort of been in touch with what's been going on here? Um, quite a lot because I've obviously still been in training. Um, my loans haven't been full time, so I've still been here, still been involved. So um, yeah, I've been still been in touch with the squad and um, gone through everything that everyone else has gone through. So yeah, it's been. It's been the same as everyone else, really. So, would you say it's been a hard season? It's been a frustrating season um, for myself and obviously a hard season for the whole squad and the club. But, um, yeah, we just got to look look forward to next season and try and put the club back to where we belong. So, what, why was it frustrating for you? Um, obviously, I didn't get the game time that I would have wanted at the start of the season. But... Um, I just had to work hard and go out on loan and prove myself out on loan and come back and try again and that's been like my season really. So, And I mean the manager said there, there might be a chance for one or two of the younger players in the squad like yourself this weekend. Have you given you any hints as to whether you might be starting or not? Um, no, not as yet but um, I'm confident that I should play a part in the weekend hopefully. Um, the manager's been good to me and a few of the young lads since he's come in and um, I think that he likes us and how we play, so hopefully the weekend should be good for us. And after you know such a tough season this year, um, are you are you excited looking forward? Although the club has been relegated, is it an opportunity for you? Do you think? I think yeah, it is an opportunity in a way, not in the circumstances obviously that I would have wanted, but um, but yeah, it probably means more games for me next season and means that I can try and do everything I can to help the club. And how how are you guys feeling now that, that Gary's signed and, and you know that he's going to be staying? Personally, I feel quite positive about it because since he's come in, I think the way he wants us to play and the philosophy that he's brought in suits the players like myself. And um, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. So, what 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 would you, how would you describe his philosophy? Um, it's quite <laughs> it's a tough one. Um, <laughs> It's quite attacking. He likes to um, counter attack quickly, um, and he plays with two strikers, which is obviously good for me. And I, I like to play with two strikers. Um, yeah, so it's good for me. And and would you say you, you as a, as a squad, you you guys are sort of how how are you feeling? Are you still down on the relegation, or or are you? Is it is it more positive feel now looking forward? I think. I think a lot of people are still quite down about it. It's a horrible thing, especially the lads that are here next year. Um, but you've got to take, you've got to be positive about situations like that, and um, you've just got to look on to next season, really. That's great. How, how, how did you enjoy the, the spell at Cinderford? It's a really proper sort of adult, yeah. a, a rough and tumble football, but after sort of settling in, you did really well. Yeah, I was, as I said before, I was quite sceptical before. I obviously went there, but um, yeah, I really enjoyed it when I was there. And um, John Brook was really good to me, and I said I knew quite a lot of the lads anyway, so I just settled in quite well. And yeah, it was quite a good period for me. That that experience of being probably kicked up in the air by the old thirty-year-old centre half, so you feel yeah. that's done done you the world of good almost, and makes yeah, you was, more ready for. Yeah, it was. It did do me do me the world of good. So have a, especially to have a run of games where. It, consecutively happened um, yeah and I, I enjoyed the battles and I enjoyed um, just playing games and the manager's actually been quite open in saying that people like you and Harry have, have impressed him in training since he's been here so so you obviously realise that there, there is now a route, route into the team under him here yeah um, since, we, since he's been here the first couple of weeks I didn't really train under him because I was at Cinderford and um, and then obviously when we got recalled we, he saw us a bit more and that was when he started to start saying some good things about us so um, yeah it was, it's was it been really good since he's been here. And I suppose the stability, the fact that he's going to be the man for the next two years is is key because it's been almost a case of having to impress a new manager every every couple of weeks almost. <laughs> yeah I know, people, isn't it? well yeah <laughs> and I think to be fair I've done I've done that under Buckle, I've got a new contract and then under this manager he's um, said some nice things about me already so um, yeah I'm looking forward to playing under him for the next couple of years. Hopefully.